Hello there everyone, this is Andre the Game Idea Guy. Thank you very much for lending me your time and your ear and listening to another game idea that I think will work out on the Wii U. And that is Level 5's Yokai Watch. And I know someone's probably wondering why I'm even doing this video because Level 5 did say that they wanted to put Yokai Watch on the Wii U. The bad thing is, I had the idea to do this video like two days before that news dropped and I was like they couldn't wait for me to put my put my my video up they just had to go and say something they just couldn't wait for me so but but no but seriously I think it would be a good idea and I've played the Yokai Watch demo and it's made me want to get the the game for the 3DS but I look at it like this if and and they don't have to do anything special because the game has an art style that would work in um in HD. You just have to up res it. And they just have to port the game up. It's not like they have to do a whole lot of extra work. But it would definitely be worth it in my eyes. <coughs> <coughs> Yokai Watch kind of feels that um that gap where you want to have um like a Pokemon type of game. I mean, Yokai Watch it isn't exactly like Pokemon. I'm not trying to make it sound like that, but it has that sort of feel to it. It has a feel to like Pokemon, and it's kind of addicting to to like play it. Like once you get going into the game, you start to earn like get to see the characters. It's interesting, and, I, and that's from me only playing a short demo, and that demo is not very long at all. But I definitely want to get the game. And find out more about it. And plus, they've got the anime out right now. So, putting it on the Wii U would be a good thing. Because someone would see it be like, oh, yo, Kai Watch. And I watched that with my kids. Maybe one of my kids will like it. Or, like, just like with the, with the 3DS. But mm, maybe there's some people out there who's like, well, I don't want to. Maybe, maybe I want to give them this version of the game. So that way, if I want to use the 3DS for something... I can do that, and they can play on the television. Just transfer the data up to the Wii U version. And vice versa. So you can free up one device if you want to use it, and your kids can still play the game if you want them to play it. Or you can play it yourself because you might be curious about it. Because you see that your kids enjoy this, this, the TV show, maybe the TV show isn't your flavor, and you want to play the game. You see the game... I'm kind of like that with Pokemon. I don't want to watch the anime. I haven't played the games. I don't want to watch the anime at all. I'll play the games, though. Now, I know I'm not the only person like that. There are several other people like that. That, now that I can think of off the top of my head, but I've known a few other people like that over the years that think similarly in that manner. Like, they don't want to watch the anime or, uh... I don't know if yo kind of watch has a manga. It might. I think it does. But they might not want to partake in the other parts, other media for this particular intellectual property. Which is fine. I mean, I'm not really necessarily interested in the Yokai Watch cartoon myself. It is okay. It's not bad, but I'm definitely not really interested in it. So I'd rather play a game. And, and all of the functionality is. Going, it would be exactly the same. It would just be on the Wii U and not the three. And it would be on the Wii U, literally. That's all. That's the only difference. And maybe the ability to have the off TV play, where it would bump the menu off of the gamepad screen, and then you could um, swap menus on the fly. Well, swap screens on the fly with it. But that's about it. Um. Yeah, I think that's really it. <laughs> Thank you very much for listening. Keep your eyes and ears out for more of my stuff. And until the next time, enjoy your games. Peace out.